Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So I've just posted a video regarding the new Spotlight user interface for Windows 11 24H2 that rolled out as part of the update KB5052093 at the end of February last month. And that will be linked down below and in the end screen. Now, I mentioned in that video because there's another feature that was part of the same update that I have noticed that's also become live because both these features were rolling out gradually and I've now received them as part of the update finally in my part of the world. And just to let you know now that you can finally turn off the annoying OneDrive backup reminders that are displaying in the file explorer if you're not using the feature. And if we head into my file explorer, I noticed earlier today that if we head to a folder and we see the start backup here to the top left and we right click there are the options now that Microsoft had mentioned from the release notes for the update where Microsoft says you can now snooze or turn off the start backup reminder in the file explorer address bar and this only applies if you are not already backing up your files and folders so just take note of that and then to view this new option as mentioned you right click the start backup icon so you right click and you can turn off the reminder or you can remind me in one month now i don't use this feature because i've got my own backup system but i'm going to turn that off and backup reminder is off to turn on backup and sync check your cloud provider settings and I actually think that is a nice move. It just gets rid of that unnecessary clutter that was taking up some screen real estate there in the address bar. And if I'm not using the feature, I would rather just turn it off. So I think that is a very nice move in the right direction. You can now snooze or turn off the start backup reminder in the file explorer as part of that update, which is now finally becoming more widely available. And just wanted to put it out there in case you were unaware. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.